final water. With another one just to leave a leg at that triple brush arrowhead. And they've done very well to sit there. Well, I can tell you the last is out on course. Sarah Bullimore and Lily Corinne, owned by the Seahorse Syndicate and Brett Bullimore. They start on 51.1 in the dressage. Well, Astia Nicola and uh, Molokai, they're clear through the last water. He is there, thereabouts on the clock. He needs to be going down the avenue at uh, 1 minute and 30 on, on uh, the clock on the right-hand side of your screen. And he needs to be at 1 minute 30 now. Well, just watch this... Uh, replay leaves a leg does that very well to stay in the saddle so he is on course to go inside the time if he does that he will go into the leads and it will be France 1-2 but there's one out there that could go ahead of in fact, can't go ahead. They're on the same score, Zagreb and uh, Alexander Bragg. He'll need to go clear and he'll need to be closer to the optimum time to go into that lead. An anxious moment at the last of the houses at 29 ABC for Astia. He checks his clock, he knows he's on target. Well, a dicey moment at the uh, grey rails at the top of the hill as he comes into the arena. He needs to come into the arena with 30 seconds to spare. He's going to be inside the time. Astia Nicola, he won in 2015 with the Piaf de Bonneville. Oh. He is living by the seat of his pants. Astia is going to take the lead barring catastrophe at the last and he's done it so he stops the clock 11 minutes and four seconds no jumping no time penalties 43 points